Shalom, everybody, from Walt Disneyland here in Anaheim, California. Why am I back at Disneyland again? Well, we love Disneyland, for one, but uh, I could say Merry Christmas along with Shalom right now. And the reason I can say Merry Christmas is because it's very much Christmas here in Disneyland. Tonight, we witnessed uh, their candlelight celebration and narrated by Edward James Olmos. It goes on all month long here. Uh, there's specific dates. Uh, Dick Van Dyke is going to narrate it. And when I say their candlelight celebration, I, I don't mean that it was a Christmas show. They didn't do the night before Christmas. There was no mention of Santa Claus. Nobody sang Jingle Bells. This was a night of pure, unadulterated worship of the King of Kings and Lord of Lords, our Savior, Jesus Christ. The reason for the season. <laughs> So, you know, I think it's easy to make a judgment call about places like Disneyland or like Disney World or uh, organizations like Disney over the basis of faith issues. But I really don't see any other massive, multi-billion dollar organizations setting aside the time to recognize the real reason for the season. When we say Merry Christmas, we say Merry Christ Mass. When we say Happy Holidays, it really just doesn't reflect the same way. It's Christmas, folks, and yeah, I know, listen. Jesus wasn't probably born on December 25th, and it's more likely and factual that it was a holiday replacement issue over a pagan holiday for the solstice. But we celebrate Jesus' birth here and this month, and I want to let you know that it's important, it's imperative that if Disney, this massive corporation, can worship Jesus in the square here, or allow the worship of Jesus here on Main Street, how much more so should we in the midst of this holiday? Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace, goodwill toward men. So while you're wrapping your presents and seeing your holiday cheer and your carols and having your hot cocoa around the fire and uh, talking about Santa Claus and Jingle Bells and all that, let's not forget the real reason for the season. His name is Jesus, and we celebrate the birth of him. He's the one true Savior, Emmanuel, God with us. He's the Lord who came and tabernacled amongst us. And I want to encourage you, wherever you are, with your family, your friends, this holiday season, that as you celebrate Christmas, celebrate Christ. Listen, we love you. Christmas is a hard time for, for a lot of people. It's a, a time where difficulties and challenges come out. We want to encourage you. Let the love of the Lord fill your heart this season with the type of cheer that God wants you to have, the joy of the Lord, for He's our strength. We love you very much. We're thinking of you. We're praying for you from right here in Disneyland, California. And we want to say shalom from Christmasland. Oh.